Hey everyone, it's Audrey with Live in Life Marketing and today I just wanted to show you real quick how you can send a private message to friends on Facebook. There's actually several ways that you can do it so let's hop right in and let me show you real quick. First one is over on the left hand side you can click on messages. This brings you up all the messages that you have received and that you've sent to anyone um, any one person or any group of people. So you can kind of scroll down and see who all the messages that you've had. Now, real quick, want to talk to you about the other box. A lot of people don't know that this other box even exists. But what happens with this is that people that are not friends with you that try to send you a private message, they are, they are if if they want their message to get into your inbox here, they have to pay a fee, I think it's like a buck, uh, to Facebook in order to ensure their message gets to you. If not, what happens is their message goes into your other box. So when you get a chance, go to your in, go over there to your messages and your other and look at all the messages that you probably have and you didn't even realize that they were there. So for right now, I want to show you if you wanted to send a new message to a friend, you would simply click new message and then start typing in their name and then click on their name. And then you would just write your message down here. And I always use my sister for these examples. Hey sis, what's up? Now, let's say that I wanted to send her a file. I would just simply click on add files and it would open up all my files with on my computer and I can go to the file and add it, okay? If you wanted to add a photo, you would simply click here. And then of course, just either hit the enter or the send button. Okay, so that's one way that you can send a message to a friend. Now let's say that you just log in and you see your news feed. And let's say that you have a friend that you're like, oh, I want to say something. Or maybe they've written something that really has um, impacted you or whatever the case may be. You just simply mouse over their name and then you would click on message. And then once the message comes up, then you can go ahead and start typing in your message right here. Hey, saw that you are on vacay. Have a great time. You know, something like that. All right. So then you would go ahead and send the message to them. But now let's say, though, that you wanted to send a file through this way. You would simply click on the little wheel up here, which is your options, and then you would click add files. So this would you would add like a document or an Excel spreadsheet. But now if you wanted to to send a photo, you would just click on the photo right here. And then, of course, if you want to send any, you know, of those emoticons, then you can the little smiley faces. All right. So now, though, that's number two. And then the third way is, let's say that you know the name of the person you want to send a message to. They're not on your news feed and maybe you've never even sent them a message before. You would just start simply start typing in their name up in the search. And I'm always using my sister. She just loves this. I know it. She loves it. <laughs> okay, so now I'm on my sister's timeline, my friend's timeline on Facebook, and I can simply just click on message. That little box pops up again, and then I can go ahead and send her the message. Now, real quick, do you want to point something out. When you are messaging a group of people, I want you to be very careful because Anybody in that group can add somebody else to the group. So for instance, let's say I wanted to send my sisters a message about a surprise birthday party that we're putting, in, putting on for my brother. Okay, so let's say I wanted to message them in a group. Here's my one sister and then my other sister. I have some beautiful sisters. Okay, and let's say Ben's surprise, you know, birthday party, right? Well, if we, if any one of these three wanted to be funny and invite Ben, our brother Ben, into this conversation, they actually could, okay? So 
just really think long and hard about what you say or what you're sharing with a group of people within messaging because they can add that person to your messages. So, okay, there you have it. Three different ways that you can message your friend on Facebook. If you have any questions, always leave me a comment in the uh, comment box below. I will be more than happy to answer them. And if you have an idea for a video that you would like me to do on Facebook, um, go ahead and email me at Audrey at LiveInLifeMarketing.com and go ahead and visit me at my website, LiveInLifeMarketing.com, where I share a lot of how to do pretty much everything on Facebook. And if you're interested in learning how to build an online profitable business, I teach you how to do that also over there. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. And now you can go send private messages to everybody on your friends list. You guys have a great 